Hi, this is John from Future Proofs, and in this video we're going to look at how you can discuss your proofs with your team within our platform, and easily create permanent, transparent records of those discussions. Sometimes you need help to work out the best solution to a problem, or even whether there's a problem at all. Queries are the way Future Proofs helps you to do this. Your queries are private. You decide who will be able to see your messages and reply to them using a simple but flexible system that minimises the emails you get while making sure that everyone knows what they need to do. Create a query by drawing round part of the proof and choosing Query from the pop-up menu. If you find that you don't get the right menu, make sure the start and end points of your loop are fairly close together. When you've typed your question, assign it to someone on your team by typing a name into the field. A list of possible matches will be shown from the people working on this project, including your own name if you want to create an aid memoir. Repeat this if you want to add more people to the conversation. You can change the list later if you need to, so don't worry too much about getting it spot on right now. When you save your query, it's immediately visible on your proof page, and you can see what the question is and who's involved in the conversation. Also, the query is immediately available to the other people you added to the list. If they're logged in, they'll see an alert on their dashboard and can filter their projects like this to see only projects with queries. If they're not logged in, they'll get an email, one a day, that lists all their new queries or replies with links back into Future Proofs. From your dashboard, you can view the details for a particular project. Initially, this shows you new messages, both queries from other people and replies to your own previous questions. Use the filters on the left to see all your currently active conversations, or all the queries, including those that have been finished with. Each conversation includes all replies with people's names and the date and time of the comment. The View button lets you see each query on the proof page. The sidebar on the right shows all the details about this query, including the people involved and the conversation to date. You can reply with custom text and even attachments, or send quick accept or reject replies with a single click. You can also add markup on the page in response to your replies, if you decide that a correction is needed after all. Don't forget that you need markup if you want any changes to ultimately be made on this proof. When you're happy that your query's been resolved, you can close it, which removes it from the proof and makes sure that everyone stops getting email reminders about it. Queries are very powerful tools in Future Proofs, and as with everything else, there's lots of documentation on our help site if you'd like to explore further. That's it for this quick introduction to queries in Future Proofs. Check out our other videos to learn more about what Future Proofs can do.